and Merry Christmas to you. This Christmas, I'm baking up all kinds of good stuff right here in my kitchen. Do you bake anything special during Christmas time? If so, on the count of three, I want you to tell me what it is. Are you ready? One, two, three. Oh my goodness, that sounds delicious. I hope that you enjoyed that this Christmas. Well, I wanted to share with you today one of my special recipes. It is Miss Amy's Ultimate Hot Cocoa. It's actually really simple to make. In fact, I just use plain old mix, hot cocoa mix. So what makes it ultimate, do you ask? Well, it is a peppermint. Yes, a peppermint. Have you ever had peppermint with chocolate? It is an amazing combination. So. The first thing I do is I add a peppermint to my cup, like so. And then I add in some hot water. And very last of all, I stir in my hot cocoa. Mm, it already smells so good. All right, so simple to make. Let me tell you one of my favorite verses. This kind of reminds me of it. It is this, taste and see how good the Lord is. The one who takes refuge in him is truly happy. That is such a cool verse. Can you imagine tasting and seeing the Lord? It actually sounds kind of funny, right? Like we don't taste people. How would we taste God? Well, <laughs> it reminds me actually of this lady that I used to work for. Her name was Miss Becky. And Miss Becky was the sweetest boss. I mean, sometimes you hear that people don't like their bosses. I loved my boss. She had the best stories and she was always so cheery and happy. And when I was working for her, she had a couple of little grandbabies. Her, her kids had babies and she would tell me about her grandbabies and she would say, Oh, I just love them so much. I just want to like chew on their little toes and, and nibble on their little fingers. And, and it was just so funny because like, it was like she could not get enough of those grandbabies. She loved them so much. She just wanted to cuddle them so close. And of course, she did not chew on their toes or nibble on their fingers. But what she was saying is she could not get enough of them because they were so sweet and she loved them so much. So when I think of this scripture that says, taste and see how good the Lord is, I think about Miss Becky, and I think about drawing so close to God that I just wanna, I just wanna be ever so close, and I wanna experience his sweetness. Um, so I just wanted to share that little nugget with you today, what that scripture means to me. Okay, so my hot cocoa is almost finished, but there is one more important piece to Miss Amy's ultimate hot cocoa, and it is the whipped topping. 